evening welcome back to another video hello everybody god bless you all and good evening today is um july 14th 2022 it is a thursday evening so happy whatever thursday so today is whatever thursday and i'm gonna do a video on today on some lip glosses and some matte um lipsticks from the company that i love and dearly to my heart is maybelline new york so yes so i have on a lip liner from of course wet n wild that's my most favorite and it's called cena brown it's an a603 so make sure you grab yourself a snack a delicious snack something to drink of your choice taking notes with a notepad of course with pen or pencil whatever you write with it's up to you make sure you're sitting back on your couch or your chair which makes you comfortable comfy you got the kids in bed and the husband is doing whatever he wants to do um and you're all done with the work day and you want to relax and watch a good video so this is a video to watch so make sure you are tuned in to another video but today is whatever thursday so happy whatever thursday god bless you all please stay safe and um yeah let's get right into the video but before i do but i hope you all had a great day today a wonderful thursday i worked all day today so i just got home and i wanted to do a video because also i want to celebrate general i have 200 videos within two years oh my god so we're celebrating that today so yay yes we're selling break sorry about my t-shirt <laughs> um yes but we're celebrating it today on a thursday of what of a thursday um july 14th 2022 time now is 9 4 p.m evening time here in the beauty room and if you're not subscribed subscribe now what are you waiting on tell your family and friends it's a youtube channel out here called the beauty room tell your family and friends family and friends family and friends friends and family <laughs> yes so yes let's get started to the video but yes make sure you are tuned in to this video make sure you are subscribed if you did god bless you and welcome to the beauty room yay Woo! so we have a lot to catch up on i have some things i want to tell you about uh, my favorite lip glosses are and my top basically from maybelline is the the super stay matte ink um lip um, lipstick or lip or no no sorry not lips lip, lost blah. lipstick excuse my word so yes it's um matte ink lipstick we're gonna try on swatching to my hand and also to my lips so let's get into this video but i want to show you what i have on my lips now it's getting ready to come off so yes let's get into it because i want to show you how they look and to see if you want to get these type of lipsticks and lip glosses um into your collection if you're a beginner in makeup yes i did my face already it's very natural today of course and of course the maybe um, the mascara i'm gonna talk today the mascara i used was it's by covergirl and this is the peacock um flare mascara and this is in 795 in black a very black but yes i love using black because of my hair is black so i love it and i have some more today see and then i curled my lashes before i put the mascara on so it can be like a little more um curlier of my own lashes and then i apply the mascara i did about two coats on top and just one coat on the bottom and i used a eyeliner from And this is from Wet n Wild. This is the, let's see what number, if I can get it, 651 in black, black. This is what I use underneath my underline. It's just like under a dollar. So make sure you definitely can get this at your local Walmart, Target, or Five Below um, for their black eyeliner. You can also use this on your brows, just a tiny bit on the edge from here and to here. And then blend it in with your spoolie brush that you have. So to get your eyes a little more darker, you know, that's just what I do sometimes, but I rotate 
on how I do my um on how I do my eyebrows. So yes, let's get started to the video. But so I just want to show you the matte um lipsticks that I got I gotten from from Walmart and one is from Target and they're they're under ten dollars right now at your local Walmart and Target maybe a little bit more at Target but I know for Walmart it's under ten dollars so yes or maybe like at ten dollars so I'm really not for sure but you want to just get your own info do your own homework on the Maybelline New York so the first one is the number 70 Amazonian now this is the one I got I gotten from Target when I used to work there but I had to toss that one out throw that away in the trash and got a whole new one that I got a few months ago at Walmart for about ten dollars or under ten dollars so yes this is the Amazonian in number 70 this is how it looks and we're gonna do a swatch so that's what it looks like on my hand and we're gonna do it on my lips Now this is very pretty, like on a date night, you know, or if you're having brunch, lunch brunch by yourself, you know, or going on a shopping spree by yourself. This is Mac, I'm sorry, Amazonian in number 70 in the matte ink uh, lipstick. Very pretty. As you can see, it's very pretty on my skin tone. And if you're any skin tone darker than me or lighter than me or medium, you know, like than me, this would definitely work for any skin, any skin tone that you are. This would definitely work, will work. So I highly recommend this um, Amazonian number 70 through the Super Stay, Maybelline Super Stay, <laughs> cannot talk, matte ink. Gloss. This is it right here. So this is the Mac. This is the Amazonian right here. I love the the like the container of it. It's white at the top, and then this is just like the color matching of the lipstick, which I love that about. So definitely, I highly recommend that you try to find this at your local Walmart and Target. And I will want to check um Amazon, but I'm really never sure about Amazon. But I know for sure. Definitely do your homework and get your info at Walmart and Target before you buy. So definitely check this out. Yes, Amazonian in number 70. I love that shade. It's, it's super pretty. It's just, you know how some uh, matte like lipsticks, you know, get that type of sticky feeling? You will not have that with this. See? You will not have that with this. And you can also as well use a brown lip liner. If you want to get like a little brown onto your top lip and, and your bottom lip and then put this on and then you can also too if you want that type of effect you can use a lip gloss and I'll show you the lip gloss that you can use so yes this is Amazonian in number 70 and now this one is in 260 the hazelnut so we're gonna try the hazelnut I gotta take this off first And it comes off very, very easily. Easily, I like that. You can also definitely make sure you use a wipe, a cleansing wipe that you, you know, take off when you apply. You know, after you had a, you know, if you had a, a week or a day at work shopping, or if you had, if you had off or something like that. Are you about to go on vacation? Are you just got back from vacation? Yes, definitely make sure you have cleansing wipes with you for to remove your makeup lipstick lip gloss your matte lip glosses and anything like that so but yeah this is in number 260 in hazelnut i like it. it has like the chocolate type of you know lid and then the lipstick container i love that this is in 260 hazelnut i'm gonna put this one on this side they look kind of like the same but the amazonian is like a little more darker you can definitely um wear this now if you like or you can wear this in the fall and winter um this you can wear this now you can wear this basically all year round you know it's totally up to you it depends on whatever um, season that you're in right now and city and state you know hot weather you know kind of cold weather 
but yeah it was about 80 about no it was about 83 and now it dropped down to 74 degrees right now in michigan so yeah Oh my goodness, you have to get this. It smells like coffee and hazelnut. You know how, you know that uh, coffee creamer hazelnut, I believe, I think it's called hazelnut coffee creamer um, by Delight. Oh my God, what it smells like. It smells super, ooh, my nose? super good. And you can tell by this look. Mm. oh my gosh you all have to definitely get this i say get about two of these i highly recommend this one as well put this in your cart walmart when you go in the stores and also you can shop online to walmart.com definitely if they do not have this try to see if you can find it in another walmart and another walmart or you can order it online it'll come with you in your mail within two to five business days it depends on your state and area but within mine mine comes within about four to five days too so normally you know normal shipping but this oh my god oh it smells so good mm, it smells like coffee like coffee that you make like fresh in the morning and then you add your creamer to it your delight hazelnut creamer oh and you know they have you know in delight i don't know if it's new to me it probably is but it's called Delight um, Caramel, not Caramel Latte, but it's like Mocha Lata or something, Chai. Mm. But see, I'm, I'm not a hot coffee drinker. I'm more of a cold, you know, coffee drinker, like from Starbucks. Um, I get the Caramel Frappuccino. That is like my top fave of coffee that I can make my own. But when I used to work at Target years ago, that was like my favorite thing to get. I would come to work two hours early to get there just to have that caramel frappuccino with the whipped cream and the inside and the caramel drizzle and the inside of it too. Oh, and the coffee is just, <laughs> it smells so good. Oh my goodness. I, that's that's my, my top favorite um, Starbucks coffee, cold coffee to drink. And also, in the wintertime, I normally get my own, you know, uh, not my own, but, um, hold on. But yeah, but I normally, you know, I don't get the hot cocoa. I usually make my own hot cocoa, you know, through the package, you know, with marshmallows or I get the one without marshmallows. So yeah, but these are the wipes that I was telling you about. These are from Clear and Clean, I'm sorry clean and clear products this removes makeup impurities leaving no heavy residue behind for bright clear happy skin and this pack was about under ten dollars i believe they may still have this lemon type of scent of um, cleansing wipes which i love lemon because lemons you know what makes your face brighter and um, glowier and more smoother to me and so is like vitamin c so yeah but those are the wipes that i normally use to remove my makeup or anything like that you know or after when i'm done cleaning my face at night for my nightly routine before i go to bed and after i get out the shower that is what i do after i well before i apply my um, I like apply my toner to my face i make sure i wipe twice with my cleansing wipe and then i apply my toner that's my last thing put my bonnet on my head and i go to bed and go to work yes so this one is the next one it's called a 265 caramel collector let's see what this one smells like this one smells like coffee too so mm. so this one is the caramel collector as you can tell everything is like in a type of brownish nudish type of color so this one is this one this one is the let's say 265 and I have another one of the 265 
What do y'all think about this one? Hmm, I think it's pretty. So I like the that they that Maybelline came out with the with the um super stay matte ink, you know, lipsticks for any skin tone of woman that you are. You know, this is super pretty. Yep, this is the 265 in Caramel Collector. Love it. I think they have some other ones too, so I gotta just see and take a look when I do have a chance to go to Walmart hopefully um this week or next week if not and get, get ready to look for that video like a walmart haul you know i love using walmart who doesn't <laughs> who doesn't these days so yeah so yep yeah, those wipes are done and i put them in my trash it's like right next to me so those are the matte um ink lipsticks that i love so much i only have three but i have two of the same ones so i only just put out the three that i have i want to collect not collect but get some more of these because these are really good they come on your lips really smooth you know it doesn't doesn't leave any residue or anything like that or anything you know that gives you that type of poppy type of lip you know that's a good thing for me so now we're going to go into my Maybelline Lifter Lip Glosses. The first one I usually have, I wanted this, I think it's called Stone or something like that. I have to go back to Walmart and see what, if they have that one. But I have the 002, and this is in ice. This is the, how this one looks like, very clear. So this goes any on top of your lipstick if you want. Or you can um, wear it by itself, as you can tell. I'm wearing it by myself. This is in the ice, the ice, um, ice zero zero two, the Maybelline Lifter lip gloss. So I do love that. Love it. That's that one. And then this one is the. Here's it. Here it is right here. This is the 008 stone. I'm going to try that. I'm going to remove this lip gloss that I have on my lips. And I do like the applicator of it because this is stone right here in 008. I love the applicator because it's big and you can also, you know, get as much product as on there as you want. And you may have to apply um, your lip gloss a couple times, maybe within an hour, hour and a half. You know, it depends on wherever you're at or state fair, you know, carnival, whichever. Or just having a really good family, good time, you know. And you want just something simple, this will work as well. Okay, and then the next one is 009 Topaz. This is this one. And this is Topaz right here. That's it right there. And now we're going to apply it onto my lips. Something was on it, cotton. Sorry. Okay. Yep, topaz. I really do like this one too as well. And these don't have a scent to them, so that's okay, you know. Because there's some lip um yeah. There are excuse me, so sorry. There are some lip glosses that does have scents. And you know they're from the from like your local beauty supply store that you know that you go to for your hair needs or whichever for your daughters, you know, um, beads, anything like that. And those are from Broadway. Now, those are just a couple dollars. You can get a whole bunch of them for under like $20, $25 at the most. That one was Topaz. 
Yep, this is in 009 Topaz. Now the next one is 004 Silk. That's the silk one right there. And I apologize if you can hear like a little noise in the background. That's my neighbors, you know, other neighbors or something like that. They're just having a discussion. So I apologize if it's too loud for you all. And I hope that you all cannot hear it. I truly, truly apologize about that. But yeah, this one is 004 Silk. I like, I like how this one looks too as well. I mean, I like them all because they go good with any skin tone that you are. And they go really good on top of any like lip liner or any lipstick. I just a lip, or just a lip liner by itself, you know, and then top it off with one of these lip glosses. Perfect, just it go. And then this one is 005 Petal. Let's put it on this hand because I have a lot on this hand. So this one is 004 Petal. It's right, right there. This one's like a pinkish type, type of mauve type of color. Pretty. I really do like this one. So I highly recommend all of the lip, the matte ink um, lipsticks and then also the Maybelline Lifter lip glosses as well. I love them. I really do because I have like a whole collection of them. Now this one is 007 in amber. I'm just going to remove my lip gloss. And this one, this one is it right here. And as you can tell, what type of color I love is nude. Anything nude. Very pretty. As you can tell. Love it. And then... I have another amber one so I have two ambers I just showed you that one and then this is like the last one and um, this one is in petal so 005 so those are all of my buy through Maybelline um, lips matte ink lipsticks and the Maybelline lifter lip gloss so that's my whole collection of both of those and I hope you enjoyed the video. And I'm going to keep this one on too at the whole video. But yes, I um, hope you all enjoy the rest of your day. Have a blessed and a wonderful evening. God bless you all. Now we're at 201 videos. So let's celebrate. Let's celebrate. Oh, 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 oh. I'm so proud of myself, first of all. <laughs> I just want to say thank you all so much for your support. Without you all, this channel, this would not be possible without you all. So God bless you from my heart to yours. You all are the Beauty Boom family for sure. Non-stop, no matter what, no matter what I go through, no matter what you go through, we go through together. We're here for one another to support one another. So God bless you all. Thank you all so much for your support, your love, your non non-stop saying keep on going keep going keep going with your positivity of your comments that really means the world to me and i truly truly appreciate it by the grace of god and his mercy jesus christ um thank you all so much so we're at 201 videos now so after this will be 201 and go up and go up beyond and more and more and more so i'm not going to give up so yes if you have any dreams and goals that you want to accomplish and do get to your bulletin board from the Dollar Tree, you know, that's $1.25. Um, get any magazines that you want and you see anything you want to accomplish, you know, or if it's for school or getting a GED or starting your own business with, with beauty, hair, 
lip gloss, you know, anything, um, anything that you want to have positive, you know, so you can pass it on to your family members or to your children, you know, or your grandchildren. Or even if it's a, even if it's like a chocolate chip cookie shop, you know, oh my God, trust me, I'll be there. Oh yeah, if it was a chocolate chip cookie, chocolate is involved in it, I'll be there. <laughs> To support, you know, not not physically, but mentally, I will be there. Um, but yes, God bless you all. Enjoy the wonderful whatever Thursday it is, whatever Thursday it's a whatever Thursday. And yes, please stay safe, stay positive, don't give up. Make sure your dreams and goals are accomplished, and you got that on paper. You got it in your mind. Stay focused because. Things in life will get you off track, but you got to keep pushing forward. Keep pushing forward and definitely have patience because I'm working on my patience too as well. Um, you know how you see other people, not not um, not from YouTube though, no, 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 no. There's people just having a really a, a blessful life, you know, and you're like, wow, what did they do within that 15, 10 years that whew, went by so fast? What did they do, you know? But it, it was never too late. I'm just wiping off the lip gloss that I had on this that I had on this arm. Sorry about that, but yeah. But um, it's never too late to start your own company business to get it off ground. You don't have to always be young. You know, you can be 40 in your 40s or in your mid 30s or in your mid 50s. You know, to start a business and you want to pass it on to your kids. You want to have it up for a few years or so. You know, maybe five years at the most. And you want to pass it on to your kids before you turn 60 and you want to retire. Or to you pass it on to your grandchildren or your great-grand. Nothing wrong with that. That is a blessing to do because, you know, it'll keep the family business in the family. You know what I mean? So, if you have any other dreams and goals that you want to accomplish for yourself, you know, if you just started, if you just got married and you want to start out like a, like a marriage, not a counseling, but like a, um, um, like a marriage couple type of company, you know, to just celebrate people, a couple's being married, and definitely you want to keep them with counseling, you know, support, you know, things like that, because there are things in marriage that we don't know, you know, we're just the outsiders not looking in, you know, um, you know, because you don't know what's going on inside of other people's homes, so definitely just continue to pray for one another, pray, 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 and have patience. With people in the grocery stores, the malls, whatever store that you go into, you know, um, beauty supply stores or makeup stores, any, you know, any other place that you go to. And if you're doing any traveling this month or this year, definitely please be careful. Make sure your eyes, you're alert, stay focused. And if you do any, like, stopping, you know, or take a rest, make sure you have somebody else or families with you or like you know you want to rent like RV you know something like that you always want to make sure you have a group or other people with you because you know now in these days in this generation in this world how people are you know you got to make sure you have other protection with you people that'll keep you you know you keep an eye on them and they keep an eye on you you know what I mean because you know what I mean because it's not you know your fault or anything like that it's just that people and their mind is not focused. It's, their mind is somewhere else, beyond gone, you know. And the, and the devil is busy. The devil is truly, truly busy. So I'm just saying just be aware, stay focused, be careful out there. Make sure you keep your hands sanitized. Make sure you have plenty of gloves. Make sure you have plenty of masks, you know, for you and your other company that's with you, you know. And just enjoy life. Just enjoy life. So, I do have a surprise for Hamilton next week. Next week, supposed to be our wedding, right? But you know how I had really bad toothache and pain, which I still do. Very vague. It comes on and off. Um, but I still need to have some dental work done to my mouth. So, yes. But um, other than that, we're just going to wait another month. I know. I want to do a video vlog about it but you know what that's okay because god has a plan and for a reason for this to happen you know for this time for next week he has something else bigger and planned for hamilton and i if you did not know that hamilton is my fiance if you just subscribed god bless you thank you 
he is my fiance and we're waiting another month to get married so the plans are still the same how we have it but we're going to just probably get married in ohio because i've heard that you can get married in ohio in one day and get your marriage license also in one day so instead of trying to wait here um in michigan for three days or a week or something like that we don't have time because it was just so much happening last week and then this week so we still have our little mini vacay that we took off so we're still going to do some things around the house get things ready for us excuse me i have a hiccup excuse me. i'm so sorry excuse me please forgive me and um yes yeah, so we're just going to wait till next month i'm still engaged so yes so yes um it's just so much going on with hamilton and me and our home and ah uh, yeah, yeah in my mouth <laughs> like everything just comes you know how you get some certain things ready or a certain time and then bam something else come you're like seriously so but anyway that's what it is that's going to be and i'm not going to be stressed out about it i have been but you know what i had to look at it to where god knows what he's doing and god had it planned for a reason was not to get married this month and to wait another month you know because there are things happening right now graduation you know graduation after graduation you got parties you know graduation party you know everything was going on this month so we're just gonna wait another month which is not a big deal to hamilton and i because we are definitely madly crazy in love with one another we're not going to give up or not getting married. We know we're just taking a back seat to it right now. But for next month, for sure, at the end of the, the end of August, um, August, I can't say the date, but it's August. I'll just say August, the end of August. So you have to let me know in the description box what day, what date and day you think Hamilton and time as well. The date that I'm sorry, the day, the date, the time of next month you think Hamilton and I are going to get married so yes let me know if you're close to that date and yes okay so um yeah let me know but god bless you all I'm gonna stop rambling and I'm gonna go to bed because I have to be at work the next morning <laughs> the morning so close so yes I'll be home at the 20 o'clock tomorrow night so yes god bless you all stay safe stay positive dream big with your goals and dreams anything anything is possible and never give up okay god bless bye